The Death and Rebirth of Love, Part 3. She prays to God and wonders if her prayers become lost in flight, life and love appear to be dead, and her heart continuously bleeds from the curse that has been placed upon her soul. From a distance, I was watching her plea. I could feel her pain as she tried to explain her compromise between the sun and moon, but her words couldn't pierce the heavens, dropping to her knees as if she fell to resurrect her life from past mistakes. Humanity chooses not to let go, but bully you into their control. As I walked closer to this sight, I noticed the moonlight reflect a prism in her eyes, and each color was a story of her design. And I said, I don't know who you are, but from the words you spoke, I know we have the same heart. I can see you are lost and confused, trying to make the pieces fit. And I know it all feels as if everything is lost, but I'm here to try and be a guide. The past is dead, the present and future is all you have. Change direction and recreate yourself before you become what you hate. And the mirrors break, and the illusions you live in, and your time belongs to the dead, and the world rearranges your face to fit a false narrative of temporary grace.